Because now, like in Berlin, you have church groups coming there with 40 people. You know, you have trade unions coming there with another 40 people. You have uh, all these people, you know, from the, even from the consulate sometimes in Jerusalem, they would come to Berlin to show some kind of solidarity. So I think uh, they are very important, these protests, the anti-war protests, but maybe it's time to shift gear and try harder to put even more attention on this. Yeah. I do think we have to shift gears and really push forward. I still think we can use this channel as a platform for activism. I just made a new playlist to promote videos. These are videos I just recently made one public again because there was a copyright dispute, a misidentification. I put this video together and added extra pictures, like the picture of Berlin. I used clips from the making of Israel vs. Israel, and that video, the making of, was uploaded reuse allowed. So one video was actually temporarily removed, and another one I made private just so I didn't get more copyright strikes against me. But I fight all copyright strikes. Please don't make copies of my videos, just link to them. I want to thank the director. He has one of my videos embedded on his website. I emailed him and he said he would help me resolve the copyright dispute. So he did contact the company to help them understand that they did misidentify it. So one video that's been private is now public again. I want to also point out that my next video is going to be about Cuba. And this is a good background video on that video that I plan next. Actually, I'm trying to make it as fast as I can. So I just wanted to let you know about that and please do check out this background information about Cuba. It's part of my interview with Noam Chomsky from 2005. This one didn't get many views and I really think you should watch it. I think it's a pretty good one. Chomsky's re-inspired me again because I just bought his latest book which is co-authored. I'll tell you an interesting thing. Unlike most of his books, this book has pictures within it, a few pictures. So if you have a policy of not buying books without pictures in them, don't let that stop you from buying Chomsky's latest book, which I do recommend. I was reading it, and there's a lot of good stuff in there. There's a link to Chomsky's book in the video description. And also, please subscribe to the email list, to the channel, of course, if you haven't already, to the Twitter account, like the Facebook page. And of course, you can follow the Google Plus page. That helps promote this channel as well.